What's up guys, it's Hamza from Kicks HQ and today we have a review of the Nike Lunar Max 1 in the Area 72 colorway. This shoe released along with all the Area 72s such as the LeBrons, Kobe's and the KD's. But this is one of the shoes that nobody has really been looking on, looking down upon. So let's get into the shoe. As you see the whole shoe is that new buck material in the black. And then you have a lot of key features of the shoe. The toe box is a mesh netting. It comes back to the new buck as you see the blue paint speckles right there. You have the Air Force One lace holder right there. And then going up you see the Galaxy pattern laces. With the mesh tongue. On top of the mesh tongue you have the Ray Gun logo along with all the Area 72 it has that logo. Going back down, you see some more of the blue paint speckles. You have a 3M swoosh that starts as a 3M silver and turns into a greenish blue. You have netting right here under the beginning of the swoosh. Going to the back, you see rocks. These are 3M. This is supposed to symbolize asteroids. Going back into the shoe, you have that Nike branding with the rocks, the blue paint speckles. Going down, there's nothing else on the back of the shoe. Coming to the inside of the shoe, you see that color changing swoosh along with some more 3M rocks. And then the same features along this inside part of the shoe. Here you see the midsole, it's a black with gray paint speckles that you see the air and then the Lunar Max midsole it runs around the whole shoe inside and out the outsole is a glow in the dark Air Force One just regular sole you see the Nike branding right there along with the swoosh as you can see right there as it's focusing you have some traction pads in the star pattern right there. And they go back to the regular cut down traction pads. And then it comes back into the stars for along the borders. And then you have the circular shaped traction. And the inside of the shoe, you have a Mars looking. It's reddish and purple colorway. It's the outer space themed colorway and the sock liner. And the inside of the right shoe, you have the Area 72 man. And on the inside of the left shoe, you have an Area 72 top secret Nike branding right there. This shoe is one of the most it's all of out of all the Area 72s, this shoe I believe is one of the most underlooked, underrated shoe because this shoe is a very nice shoe. As long all the shoes have the 3M, but I think this incorporates it better in all the Area 72 outer space themed, such as the asteroids, the outer space sock liner, and the blue is supposed to resemble stars. Uh, this shoe. And it has the cool feature of the glow in the dark soul, as you see right there. I like this shoe because not a lot of people have this shoe. They always have the KDs and the main branches of the Nike Sportwear collection, KD, uh, LeBron, and all of them. So this shoe is like one of the underrated shoes. So that's why I picked them up from Sneaker Frenzy yesterday. It's another look at the Area 72 Lunar Maxis. And this has been a review of the Nike Lunar Max in the Area 72 colorway. Uh, remember to like, comment, rate, and subscribe and all that. See you soon.